If you're looking to do things in downtown, oh my god. <laughs> if you're looking for things to do in downtown Los Angeles, keep watching this video. Welcome to downtown LA. We're going in. We're going in. All right. We got the whole train to ourselves. They have the bench seating on both sides. Woo! Thank you, guys. We're at the first stop of the day. We're at Angel's Flight and it's a $1 train ride and it's actually the shortest train ride in California. It just goes right down the hill and it comes right back up. So if you guys want to do it, it's fun to do. This is sick. We're at the Broad Museum and this place is awesome. And cherry on top, it's free. 100% free. You guys could sign up online in advance or you could do the standby tickets. We did the standby tickets and we waited probably like one minute in line and we were in already. They have a store in the first floor where you can get your souvenir. Walt Disney Concert Hall and is right next to the Broad Museum. So two of the most famous orchestras in the world, they perform here. Okay guys, it's lunchtime and we came to Grand Central Market because they have a little bit of everything here. They have oysters. They have pizza. They have Mexican food. Chinese food. They have seafood here. They have dessert. They have an actual market where you can buy produce. They sell cheese, coffee, desserts. This place is a must. They have a lot of food. The only thing is that you need to find your own seat. And that's tough during lunchtime here in LA. I got the shrimp chop suey. It comes with soup and the white rice. It's good. It has a lot of gravy, but it's good. So I wanted a little something different. I wanted pizza, so I came to Oleo Wood Fire Pizza. A little greasy, but good. made it to the last bookstore and we're on the first floor it's just a regular floor on this side they sell records and books but we're trying to go upstairs to the second floor and we're gonna show you guys what's going on up there it's crazy check out this book hallway This is a horror vault. They actually have horror books in here and it's right behind me. This is an amazing bookstore and they also have an amazing designs inside. We're 
at the city hall building. We are on the observation deck. It takes a while to get up because first you have to go through security, then you have to get this visitor pass that we got right here. Then you have to go through the first elevator all the way up to the 22nd floor. You gotta go to another elevator to the 26th floor. And then you can take the stairs to go to the 27th floor. And then when you get to the 27th, you have an amazing view like this. Unfortunately, there's so much smog outside that you can't see the Hollywood sign. I also want to tell you guys that it is absolutely 100% free to come up here in the observation deck. And it is Monday through Friday, 8 in the morning to 5. It is a government building, so be sure you come Monday through Friday. We are now entering the oldest part of Los Angeles. We are now at the Pueblo de Los Angeles. And you guys could see they got the gazebo behind us. We are now at Avila Adobe. This is the oldest house in Los Angeles, built in 1818. I'm about to give you guys a quick tour. Let's go check it out. they have the greatest taquitos so if you really want to try Mexican food come to this place they have a lot of restaurants so you can try delicious tamales tacos tostadas pozole menudo all the Mexican flavors are right here bubblegum Right in front of City Hall and right next to it is Grand Park and this park is pretty cool because it's different levels. We made it to the third level. Okay, now we are in MOCA, the Museum of Contemporary Arts, and we just got two tickets plus the little guy's free. It's $15 for adults, and they have a lot of stuff to look at here. Let's go check out what they have. So far, this one's my favorite because I love hearts, I love flowers, and I really like the colors they put in it. have a little gallery or a little museum going on now we jump back in the elevator we made it to the 70th floor look at this amazing view so we couldn't see the Hollywood sign earlier but now we can see it because we're on top of the smog hey it's slide time and I'm getting a little nervous in the service right now no not really I'll be all right yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not. Nothing really. It goes down pretty quick, so really had a chance. Woo. The views up here are amazing, and we're waiting to take our picture with the wings behind me right there. So there's a full bar up here too on the 69th floor, and I'm kind of getting thirsty. Wow, 
wow, it was sick up there and it's definitely worth it. It's $25 per adult. There's two observation decks. You go down the slide. You could have some drinks. You could have some food. I mean, they have a DJ, bars, restaurant, food. It's perfect like for a date or maybe to celebrate your birthday with this view. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give me that thumbs up like. If you really liked it, check out this video right here or go to my channel and subscribe. I'll put a clickable link right here. We will see you guys on the next one. Bye.